Hey guys, this is Bobby Stuff coming at you with another video, and I just wanted to do a quick review on the Spy Deer, um, Spy Deer GoPro 45-in-1 accessories kit, and also the uh, Geek Pro 2. Um, I just wanted to do a quick review on that and show you the pieces and the camera. So I'll start off with the Geek Pro 2. Um, this is the little case it came in. It's, um, it's a pretty nice, durable case. And um, I am going to use this for snowboarding, um, aquatics, like I surf. And I uh, just wanted to show you some of the things that came in the kit. Um, first is this little um, monopod mount. This is the uh, female end. And you would stick your camera. This is the camera in its waterproof case. Um, and to open the camera, there's a sliding buckle right there. Move it to the left. Then push this part open um there we go like that and it pops open open that part back door opens this is a skeleton case pretty nice with all the buttons and then this is the little camera insanely lightweight is the power button the capture button up down volume and there's a little speaker right there a little diamond and then there's a battery compartment right here. And so yeah, and this camera would fit into this just like that. And it's not going anywhere. You have to take it out of the waterproof case to put it in there. But yeah, that, the waterproof case, obviously the camera this mount this little buckle thing that you use on the waterproof case and um a bigger mount that um i have right here this big one right here that one this it's very tricky to mount um this particular mount on that one the buckle one it's very tricky to mount that on this, so um, I like to use the GoPro accessories kit from the Spy Deer, and it just, all the things from GoPro, it just slides the buckle in nice and easy, and it snaps, and it's not going anywhere. To take it out, you press these two tabs on the front, and it slides out. And now, let's move on to the um accessories kit um the accessories kit comes uh the accessory kit comes with a um a big very big case a female and the monopod again some uh some mounts uh a hang tie you put this around your gopro and it will keep it secure this is the foam uh inserts that you can put inside of the gopro case to keep it from fogging up this is the monopod with the male end extends up to i believe three and a half feet or 36 inches so just three feet and then it comes with a for those of you who are into aquatics like me it comes with a floaty like a sponge floaty back door that you just slap onto the back of the camera and with the adhesive, adhesive mounts and then this floaty uh, grip that will bring your camera to the surface and keep it filming down so if you were in clear water and you wanted to film yourself diving or something you could just let your camera float on the top of the water as long as there are no big waves there and then it comes with this curved mount so like that with a buckle um, and then two mounts like that, that, uh, basically 
use it to change the 90 degree camera angle and then these I call them jaws they are this really powerful it takes a lot of force to open them but they will clamp onto something and you can mount your camera there and it comes with a handlebar mount um, with two thumb screws and then a third for the camera this comes in really helpful if you're wearing a uh, if you're riding a bike or something here's just the regular flat mount that comes with it and then there's this also a handlebar mount with these two big straps and the mount in the middle and then it comes with this thing that you slip on your wrist and there is a button that you hit right there and it will lock the it will lock this thing or it will unlock this thing so you can turn it change the camera angle but then when you want to completely lock it down you press the other side and it's not going anywhere and then of course you have the head mount with the um this is not a you do not mount the camera like a buckle like a sliding buckle you have to mount the uh camera directly onto this with the j hook or whatever and this is very comfortable synthetic and then you also have of course the um the chesties and this is what they're called it's what's listed on gopro and you basically wear it like a harness and um that's pretty much that and it comes with another handlebar mount uh the this handlebar mount came with the geek pro this one feels more heavy duty came with the gopro accessories kit and then you have these little velcros which i will probably never use it's just uh to velcro um your camera in case it's falling off but that's what the fall line is in there for. And I believe that about covers it. Um, oh, there is this USB cable that comes with your Geek Pro or GoPro. And you can use that to charge. Four hour charge and the card. I just discovered this. The card can only take 32 gigabytes micro SD card. Um, not a 64 or anything above 32 but it can take anything below 32 just nothing above and um this the camera is i found it very useful um it's it's 100 percent waterproof till 98 feet and this is like kind of complicated to open so as you can see earlier in the video i was having trouble opening it but when you get it open, camera is inside, all nice and shiny. So, um, yep, that's uh, that pretty much sums it up. Uh, thank you for watching. Please subscribe. I will see you later.